So if I oh. yep, set up. Okay. Bring that whole thing closer. Bring the whole rocket closer. Shoot up there. There you go. Stand up your rocket. Now give me twenty. Sorry, we can. Remember, this has got to protect this. It's the best way you can think of to do that. Yeah. Now, this is what you're trying to protect, right? You've seen me do it a couple times, so I can't pull that up for you. So we Good thing about a six inch diameter tubes, you got plenty of room. And a little one like mine, it's gonna have as much. So for this one, I pull it I like, like a forward that and then you might put like one pull it up, pull it up smaller. Okay. Sort of rolling it up so all the lines are Twist here. Oh, it's gonna be fine. He is. You don't want the nose cone coming off when the motor stops pushing the rocket. So basically, what you're gonna do is try to, try to pull the nose cone off. It takes more of a force. The key is to the test is pick it up like this. And just like that is barely okay. The uh, I'm just gonna say to tell you the uh, the L3 guy said he, he said this was too uh, tight. Too tight. Remember, temperatures change, it's warmer, everything changes as you go on, so you actually need to check this at the pad. Tape's going to roll up, and as it rolls out, it's going to give you a false idea of tightness. Our test is, the motor in it, that's what it's rolling up. Working on that. Not, rolled up like not shake it really hard, but just kind of shake it to see if it's going to It's rolling up the tape. Yeah. 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 Take an exacto knife or tear it and get the whole thing out. It's going to keep rolling I think I brought up. my exacto That's the pinata rocket. <laughs> they actually have a pinata rocket here. <laughs> several tons, several tons, several pounds of candy are are, are in it. Huh. Yeah, yes, I'm new. Uh, yeah, your dad has seen it. Really, they do it. The end of the day. Get the last. I don't see that guy. Yeah. 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 About straight the way you want it. Um, Right there? No, it's true. From this angle, I believe so. Uh, you can know, always adjust in this angle. Not in that one. Uh, at the end, toward the end of the day. <laughs> in this case, it's a, little, yeah, it's a little bit this way, but is there a way to lean it back a little bit more? Sure. We'll see. We'll see if we're still here. We're going to be up in the other day because Tony's not here. Did somebody else bring it? That looks great. Okay. Awesome. What do you think, Dave? I have to warn you, Tony's not here. And it's his yeah, room. I like it a lot. Oh, that's awesome. Get him out of here. Yeah. Tony, what's the problem? Why aren't you here? Yeah. Tony, you're flawed. There's a good rule is take these and hit them together. Is that like clean it or just... No, it's you're looking fun? for sparks. Oh, is this... Uh, does that say this? What if a relay welded shut on the last flight? What would happen? It would set your motor off when you hooked up your igniter. Oh, God. <laughs> so... Oh, it sucks. So you just don't see any sparks, right? So you're good. Oh, nice. <laughs>
sounded nice. We try. <laughs> so rumor has it you've forgotten more than everybody here knows put together. I don't know about that. That's what we've heard from Mr. Kalinsky. Yeah, well, rumor might say that, except that I flew the first flight of the day and it's buried somewhere oh, over there. That was so, yours? Yeah. All right. <laughs> so that's how smart I am. Some cow is going, I found it. I haven't found it yet. <laughs> oh, we got to go on a search party. Why don't you un undo those 90s so you have a straight thing. You're going to want to push that all the way as far far as you can to the front of the motor because you want the burn to start at the front and come to the rear that's yeah you remember about how long the case was so that's how much straight you need you can use your feel when it hits hits the wall